So Adrian bought a ton of tools like an hour ago. Or well, half, well, half a ton, he says. <laughs> and this is one of them. And Milo has been sleeping on this box now for an hour and he doesn't want to move because it has a very comfortable like a pad. Milo, are you comfortable? Yeah. Really? <laughs> Another decal. Route 66. Thank you very much. Whoever. No name on this, so I don't know who you are, but thank you very much. Trading Post is Peter. How can I help you? Any what? Accordions? I don't have any accordions at the moment. No. You're welcome. Bye bye. Believe it or not, accordions sell pretty damn good. Not many people, not many people have them. Not not many of them are out there unless you go on eBay. So anytime we get any accordions that we that we decide to put in a shop, good sellers. Ruby, what? Seriously? And we had this here for a long time. How much they sell it for? Ninety dollars total. Yes. Yeah, if you want to leave, like, well, there's two there's also like a battery pack and then that stand. So yeah, I mean, so probably, for probably like 85, not 90. Yeah. Go for 90 with... Because there was also... Okay. But so yeah. this, right? Yeah. So I'm gonna have to... Yeah, yeah the cartridge, that, that base in that box there. Phone number. Our for the stand. Is it this? this yeah, that that was the other thing listed here. It's got the, uh, the battery so pack. Much, it's like a, I don't know, a charger for your phone. So. Okay, I don't know. I'm gonna have you just hold on to this because this isn't part of. Yeah. It might have actually been. Hurt. All right. Is this is part of that? We'll yep. Okay. Awesome, you. You're welcome. <laughs> oh, this is gosh. definitely part of this though. So what's the scoop? What are we doing? Holding on to it for now. Until we know how they want to proceed, I guess. So the husband is what? Husband is claiming that she had one missing? No, I'm assuming husband, it's a husband. husband or son, I don't know. No, it's um step son, but he's he's twenty six years old. Okay. So Well she yeah, she was probably what? Fifty? Forty five, fifty? I Something would think so, yes. I'm not really sure. That's what I would say. What time are you guys open till today? Today's 6. Saturday, 6 p.m. Okay. All right. Well, Can you guys we'll, yeah, we'll put set this it aside, aside for me? And you let us know, figure out what the hell they want to do, you know? All right. I would hate to lose it because I'll be, you know, or she can try to come in, buy it back. So, is he pressing charges from? Well, I have to talk to them. Okay. But um, you can't give this back to her. You can't sell it to anyone. Okay. That makes sense. Now, if she decides to come in to buy it back, <laughs> I can't. <laughs> okay. If if they come in with you and the other kid, so the you can't. So you cannot. You have to hold on to this right now. Okay. I have to go and make sure that this is the correct serial number. Okay. All right. Unless I can just give him a call real quick and verify the serial number. Yeah, let me do that instead. And then I'll just take it. If that's easier for you. Now if you just take it... Well, I don't want to just take it without knowing it's the correct serial number. Okay. Because I'm... I don't want to just take it and then come back. Now, like, oh, it's not now, the right serial number. Did he file like a report? That yeah, was this stolen? is a residential burglary. Oh, there yeah. was a burglary. Okay. So this is the um, the only thing I don't have is the matching serial number right now. Okay. It's Anthony and it's Anthony. Right. Same last name. Right. This is all. But then you know if <sighs> see, I I don't want to be also in a situation that. They have a burglary, but she came here to sell it. It's her stepson, and now they're playing the game that they got the money, and now they're getting their product back. You know what I mean? If they know each other. 
Well, yeah, I was going to say what the recharge is against her for stealing it, though, no? I get what you're saying. You know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah, I'm, yeah, it's not going to have, yeah, it's not going to fly. So, let me, I'll be right back. Okay. So I get this email through eBay. Hi Pete, been watching your YouTube videos for some time now. I know you're probably very busy, blah blah blah, Christmas time. I have a question. If you have an item that you know is probably worth money, but you can't a whole lot of information on it, how do you go about listing the item? Vicky! Vicky! So if I don't know anything about the item, <laughs> I call Vicky. And says, Here, do, do research. I give it to Vicky and I say, go do research. What's wrong with it? Just and worry. list it. You know, you're playing with me. Well, I'll read this email. Uh. Well, that's what I do. <laughs> If I can't figure out what something's worth, I call Vicky and she fixes the problem. <laughs> okay. All right, so all joke aside, um, when you have an item that you think that it's worth a lot of money, put it out there for a lot of money. You can always lower the price down. You can always come down. And the history and people will tell you if this item is worth you know, any money. If you get a bite right away, great, it's sold, right? But if you don't, if you don't get any watchers, any views, uh, that means there's no interest on an item. Then you can just lower price every week or, or every 30 days, whatever you decide. But put it out there for seven days, let it marinate, and you can always drop the price down slowly every, every single week. That's how I do it if you can't find any research. Who are you talking to? Myself. I'm talking to myself. Why? I'm recording. The other option is you always can do search on Google Images. Um, a lot of times you can find a lot of things on Google Images. Facebook groups, uh, find Facebook groups that are in that typical niche and throw it out there, take a couple pictures and, and people will help. People will answer your questions. So, uh, But for the most part, if we are not sure if something can bring good money, we'll just throw a crazy number and let it marinate and slowly uh, slowly drop it down every week or every couple weeks or every 30 days, whatever you decide to put the item for. So I hope that helps. All right, so it's a DC Invicta. Yeah. There's a watch. Can't believe they made them so big, you know? Yeah, you can't kill somebody like with it, you know? Yeah, my brother brought it for me for a birthday present. I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna wear that thing. <laughs> now I need a battery for my car. So your arm gets sore from the man. That thing, your you thing. just don't know how you heavy that thing is. Weightlifting with this thing, you and know. You can't reach in your pocket for your change because the watch gets in the way. I can't. I ain't gonna wear it. <laughs> All right, it's a Batman edition. Yeah. And it looks like it needs a new battery. No, she's no, running. No, that's, okay. that's brand new watch. Okay. That right. watch ain't never been worn. Well, I'm saying you could be brand new, but the battery could still it's die. Still go down. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah you know? it's okay. Been a couple months since he bought. That's the bra. And you said it fits what? For a 2014 Impala. Okay. Never been put on the car. Is it still sealed? Open. No, it's open. Okay. Papers, books, everything in there. Okay. Yeah, what do you eat? Your finger. How you doing, man? Okay. How you doing? It's never been installed. Oh, pull it out and yeah. look at yeah. it. Yeah. The white card in there. Big L's. Oh, I got some diamonds and sapphires. But I'm just trying to get. Yeah. Right there. I'm trying to get enough money to buy this battery. Oh no, you're looking at the wrong one. That ain't no diamond there. 
So what are you saying? I got diamonds yeah. and I got yeah, sapphires yeah, and... That's a sapphire. The little ones is the diamonds. Yeah, I want like because they... That's they real gold here. Yeah, though. They give me little. Yeah. You stay there, eh? Yeah, that's... Why was there the posts are oh, 10 carat. Okay. Yeah. Uh, you got only one yeah. of these, right? Yeah, it's just one of that one. Thanks to my little granddaughter. Oh, really? That's good. I just bought them the other day. The receipt is under, under there. From Zales, if that's the little diamond you're looking at. No, the, the oh, them Zales too. Wow. I don't buy that free market jewelry. But yeah, we, see, just the stones by itself, we don't really do really well here with diamonds, you know. So, well, see, the thing is this: I'm just, I'm trying to get this stuff up for a package deal. Yeah, and. I don't think you can lose. I'm even throwing this thing in. I work in one school district now. So since I get out there, I never come back. And you said you don't deal with the platinum stuff, right? Hey, what what are you doing here? If it's real platinum. Yes. It's real platinum. No, 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 but that. Did they, did, they, did they buy stuff here? Did they buy, buy stuff here? Did they sell or what? Did they trade or you didn't eat them? One of the stones going out there. Oh, okay. No, but if I buy these stuff, did he buy it from me? Yeah, don't you see? Okay. Oh, okay. They give you a price? Okay. Yeah. It's good, good idea. Yeah, I might, yeah. I might bring some stuff. I'll look it up and see how much it costs and then bring it down. Gotcha, man. Yeah, because sometimes, you know, you don't know what to do with stuff. Right. Sweet, yes. Anything you get, you know, it's good. That's the man that You have to test it because it ain't stamped. Hmm. That's what I was going to ask you. How do you know it's platinum when it says right on it's stainless steel here? So It says stainless steel. Right on it, right on the back. Oh. You got to put it against this and then put your eye to it. So I don't know if you... You see it? I don't know if you can see it. That's good enough. <laughs> I see it. Yeah, it's stainless steel. Well, how is it? It don't. It don't tarnish. It don't. Uh, stainless steel will not tarnish on you. Silver will, but not stainless steel. If this was platinum right here with all these diamonds, you would have had a twenty thousand dollar bracelet here. No, I didn't expect the diamonds to be real. I... So th platinum this is the rule. Real. If it's a platinum. 99% they will actually put, put real, real diamonds, diamonds in. so and and this is just glass in it so it tells you right away unfortunately this jewelry I'm not gonna be interested even that one ring that you had that one earring that was 10 carat there and I'll tell you why because for stones I don't pay a whole lot here I can pay you for the gold but it's so light it's so tiny you got just a few bucks there you know what I mean this, on the other hand, yes, I will look it up and I can tell you what I can do on a watch and the cover. Um, well, maybe that'll bring me. What about this little TV here? No, I don't want it. I just don't want it. I did, yeah, I got probably four or five small TVs back there. They just sit here. Yeah, but you know? I'm running out like 10 it's bucks. It's hard to so. sell it, eh? That's what I'm asking. 10 bucks. I can't That's what no, you asked. Huh? Because for something like this, these tiny, you go to Goodwill or Savers right. and they have them for 9.99. Right, so, right. You know what mm -hmm. I mean? You didn't have that much sale. Those TVs are like nothing now. Man. It's too many. They are so cheap now, you know? Yep. I mean, what do you want to get out of this watch and this cover? You tell me. I mean, what do you need to get out of it and I'll tell you if I can do it or not. Can you pay half for what each one worth? You, they both brand new. You ain't gonna find a watch for under 239 on there. And you know, they got a lot of different prices starting from 800 all the way down. To right, but I'm looking actually what's sold. So what yeah. people are willing to sell, I mean, pay for it. You know, you can ask whatever you want. Um, And like this, you know, the Batman watch that I'm finding, this one sold November 30th, sold for 200 bucks, right? I mean, mm -hmm. this is your watch. This is new, not used. Mm -hmm. um, this I can offer you 100 bucks. The cover, 
The problem with this is I'm waiting for the special buyer who has this car, I who wants know. to buy, I you know what I mean? Know. I so, know. And plus you're gonna have to take 2014 Impala on there because that's what it's for. Yeah. I know what it's for, it's that's my car. car. Yeah. Uh, and they put a, another car on the cover, you know, yeah. that's, so you so they can see it, you know. But what's your offer on it? Honestly, for this, like 20 bucks. Give me 30. I can't, I just, yeah, I, I, it bite me, take me a year or two or three to say who knows where I'm gonna get somebody who needs this particular thing, you know, so. This I have no problem. I can do like a hundred bucks, but this. Okay, give me the 120. Let me get up the road because I got a lift driver here <laughs> who's got to be going. <laughs> All right, man. I, I appreciate you. you. I appreciate. I appreciate I'm just being you doing honest, that. man. I yeah, appreciate yeah. you doing that. You told me to come in, bring mm -hmm. it in, let you look at it. Let me have your ID so I can and write you, you up. You didn't send me back empty-handed. So I do appreciate. It. Oh my God. I hope. Uh, I hope eBay or USPS starts catching these people because I hate stuff like this. So Adrian ordered these chargers. These are just the cables for like iPhones or iPads. Um, Cause we sell a lot of phones here and we always need cables. And the regular supplier that we buy these is out of stock currently. So Adrian went on eBay and bought this from a guy, 10 of them. There's 10 pan in this envelope and it's probably about a pound maybe a little bit over a pound altogether um, and look what they send at this at one pound rate USPS media mail so they probably paid like for four ounces like 250 or 266 whatever it is media mail sending at the pound rate um, Man, these sellers are abusing the system. I hate that. Oh, and you guys know what, what's the worst about this? Because I just noticed he uh, he charged us $7.95 for shipping for this. That's BS. I'm going to find this guy. I'm going to send him a message. And, uh, and this actually is supposed to uh, originally... It's supposed to arrive on the 8th. Today is 11th. So it's three days late because obviously it went media mail. So it took longer to get here. It's BS. Some of these sellers. Adrian, are you happy? Oh, I'm happy. He's very happy. Adrian's got a gift. Well, not from me. He's got a gift from Mario. Mario, thank you very much. Mario just sent us this beautiful coffee cup that it says Poland with a Polish Eagle on it. And Adrian loves it. He wants to put it yeah. on his boat. I'm going to take it and keep it in the boat because so. it's got this white bottom. So when the cell, I have a sailboat. So when the sailboat heals, it won't fall. Awesome. Yep. Thank Thanks, you. Mario. Appreciate it. I hope you're enjoying the watch. It looks like you are.